wave light is commonly defined as an electromagnetic wave. But what is an electromagnetic wave? And also, what is electric and magnetic about light? Let us refresh our mind. We've learned that waves are temporary disturbance that transfers energy from one place to another. There are two important ways on how energy is transported in the world around us. We have the mechanical waves and electromagnetic waves. To discuss the differences between the two different waves, let's hear it from Andre Pangilinan and Ashley Tagaka. The first type is mechanical waves. Mechanical waves are traveling through matter such as solid, liquid, gas, or plasma. And these are called medium. And electromagnetic waves such as visible lights differ from mechanical waves. They do not require a medium to propagate or to transfer energy. This means that electromagnetic waves can travel not only through air and solid materials, but also through a vacuum or space. Now to dig in more deeper, let's focus on how electromagnetic waves are formed. Electromagnetic waves are formed when an electric field comes in contact with a magnetic field. Electricity and magnetism can be static, but changing magnetic field will induce electric field and vice versa. By these changing fields, it forms electromagnetic waves. Always keep in mind that the electric field and magnetic field of an electromagnetic wave are perpendicular or at right angles to each other, and it is also perpendicular to the direction of the EM wave energy. Take note that electromagnetic waves travels in a constant velocity of 300 million meters per second or simply 3 times 10 raised to 8 meter per second in a vacuum space. And EM waves are also considered as transverse waves. Electromagnetic waves are deflected neither by the electric field nor by the magnetic field. However, they are capable of showing diffraction or interference. And now, let us discuss the characteristics of waves. First is the amplitude. Amplitude is a height of a wave and usually measured in meters. Remember, also that the amplitude of a wave is associated with the amount of energy a wave is carrying. The second one is the wavelength. It is the distance between the two consecutive crest or trough and usually measured in meters. Last is the frequency. It is a wave passing to a point in a certain of time that we are normally used. So this gives a frequency a unit of hertz. Since 1 hertz is equal to the wave per second. Just remember that the smaller wavelength, the higher the frequency, energy, and hazard. To summarize this all up, there are two important waves, the mechanical wave and the electromagnetic wave. The constant velocity of electromagnetic wave is 300 million meter per second or simply 3 times 10 raised to 8 meter per second. And last, we characterized waves by amplitude, frequency, and wavelength. エントリーを締め切りました。ゲームを開始します。ゲーム生きるか死ぬか。ここに一人ずつお入りください。Electromagnetic wave. Electromagnetic wave. Electromagnetic wave. Electromagnetic wave. Electromagnetic wave. Electromagnetic wave. Mechanical wave.